All right, so here we are going to talk about uh, the XYFX. So in order to record an XYFX to a track, you need to do this on a separate audio track because the MPC will not allow you to record any XYFX from the main output. So the way to do it, first you export your song as an audio track. You import that audio track into a new sequence and then you record some automation on that track and then finally you re-export that into a song i have a sequence loaded here <laughs> So I'm just going to export this one. All right, so I have exported this. I'm just going to go to uh, any unused sequence. And from here, let me just double check something on the BPM. Okay, so the sequence is at 140 BPM. I'm going to go to the, to the audio track, edit audio, browse samples. And I'm going to find my sample that I've just recorded. Where is it? Pretty sure I called it ABC or something. Okay, so it's here. I'm just going to load it first. Go to the main edit audio. Okay, here it is. So, I need to trim the beginning of the sample. So, for that, I will go back to sample edit. So now I'm on the audio track. I'm going to click on uh, XY. XY location will say program. So I'm just going to play it once. So I click on the setup and the preset here. I'm going to select the low pass filter and then I click on play start. <laughs> So in order to record this in, I need to to set my my automation to write mode. And once I am satisfied, I switched back to read. So that's how you record the automation and after that basically uh, you would need to export this uh, on a new track so 
in order to export you go to uh, your sequence you click on project and from here you can select export and uh, export that audio mix down so that's it